Well, good Super Bowl Sunday, friends. Mark Holmes here, and as always, I want to say thank you all for watching, commenting, subscribing, and being part of the Joe Boo Sports Report. Without you guys, as well as you ladies, you know that this literally does not work. You know, I am a diehard Dallas Cowboy fan. You can see, you know, Dallas Cowboys for life. I love my team and things like that. And I, I quite often trash other teams. You know, I can't stand the San Francisco 49ers. I have to respect them getting to the Super Bowl, but I hope they lose. I, I really and truly hope they lose. But at some points you have to realize that football is just a game and people matter more than anything else. And I, I've been talking with and trying to help my good friend, Philly 500. Uh, he, he's an Eagle fan, you know, and all that. But, you know, at, at some point, we're all humans, and we need to look out for each other. And he's gotten some devastating news today. Um, he's on the West Coast, so he's three hours behind. And when he woke up, he, he got this news, and it was devastating. It was truly devastating. He was talking to me, and I was trying to console him and trying to make him feel better and let him know it's going to be okay. It's so bad that Philly 500 is, he, he, he's like, I can't even do the game today. He's like, I'm so depressed that I can't even do the game today. And, and I'm just, I just want to help him, and I want you guys to keep him in your thoughts because this news is just terrible. It's so bad that after talking to him, he's just like, you know, uh, he, he was like D-Law. He was tired, but he said he wasn't tired, like physically tired, that he's just depressed. And so now he is fighting depression. Um, and he is a good friend of mine, and I worry about him because this is just bad. I don't know if he'll be able to recover from this. When he said that all he wanted to do was just go take a nap. That he just wanted to shut down and just, just hide. I, I, the only thing I could think of was get Michael Anthony Fitness nap time coordinator to give him a call to try and help him out to make sure he gets his nap done the right way. And um, I tried to make him laugh to feel better. I I, I literally did, but it, it didn't help any. I mean... The fact that Hassan Reddick is their, their best pass rusher is able to seek a trade. <laughs> ah, it's so funny. Oh, my God. This is a, th th to, to put that in, in the same equation, that would be like we wake up to the Cowboys saying, Micah Parsons, you, you, you can seek a trade if you want, buddy. Because you look at that and say, that's the best defender you got on that sorry-ass defense. And somehow, you can't figure out how to keep him, bro? Really? Really? Oh, yeah, Philly. Go to sleep. Go, go to sleep, bro. Go to sleep. Because that shit. <laughs> oh, Philly. Little Philly. <sighs> That just made me feel a little bit better. I'm Mark Obes, and well, you know I love you, son. Disrespected yet? Does this defense have any heart? Let's no, go. they suck. I've been telling you all season, they Philly. Shit on you. Oh. They've shit on you. <laughs> Don't you hear me, Jordan? Caleb <laughs> Carter, it's like they shit on you. Oh. They've shit on you. <laughs> they have shit on you. Don't. Don't you hear me, Jordan Davis, <laughs> Caleb Carter? It's like, they shit on you. Kill them. Oh, my goodness. Did he say they, they cock it on them? I hate the style of defense. I <laughs> and they got killed more. <laughs> 